I will be forever the myth. You're the king of kings, <laughs> There's always a pecking order. The little peckers never mess with the big peckers. So I'm a rooster, and he's a chicken for the week. Chris Cormier, chilling in the house, getting ready for the USA, baby. Well, this guy is noted for incredible strength. Chris Cormier from Los Angeles, California, originally from Palm Springs, 235 pounds. Look at that shot there. Look, look, at, look at that package, upper body, lower body, uh, just symmetrical, great condition. Uh, he's done his homework here. He was a great uh, champion wrestler and football player. I've seen this guy train in the gym throws around amazing package, uh, poundages. Uh, I'm, I'm a fan of guys that uh, train heavy. This is one of the strongest bodybuilders I've ever seen. Well, he trains occasionally with Flex Wheeler. That'll uh, make you disciplined. That's a good training partner. Uh, I've seen this guy incline uh, 500 pounds for a couple reps. Just amazing natural strength. <laughs> Thousand pound hack squats. Hack squats. Hack squats. Yeah, that's, uh, that's difficult. <laughs> That uh, that's would make most people's patella tendons pop right off the bone. <laughs> he, he, he's a strong one. It hurts something for me, I guarantee yeah. you. Yeah, the, you can see the uh, the heavy poundages in this guy's physique. So where do you figure Chris to finish tonight? He's right there. I mean, he's just in incredible shape, uh, not missing a body part, uh, very, very good presentation. Um, he's hit it. Well, as I mentioned, he was formerly from Palm Springs. Uh, I guess he started making trips out to Venice, California, and decided that was for him. So came to Venice to train, I, um, every time I went, I was traveling back and forth from Palm Springs to Venice, Palm Springs to Venice, I was making good connections with a lot of uh, photographers, writers, and just getting to know different people, and it seemed like a good move, so I tried it, and I've been here training for three years now. Well, the buzz backstage was that Chris Cormier was the man to beat. What do you think, Jim? Well, that might well be. Uh, you know, the kind of conditioning he has with the 235 pounds of muscle uh, looks phenomenal. But here they come for that pose down. Terry Taylor, Chris Faldo, Vinny Galante, John Simmons, Chris Cormier. They're all out there. And what will happen now? Well, they'll do comparison poses. They'll, uh, the judges will set them through that. And then it'll be an all-out free-for-all, which the crowd absolutely loves. <laughs> That's when things get interesting, isn't it? Yeah, there's no holds barred in that one. Well, they'll warm up to this kind of solely, and then it will start to fire up. And while they complete that warm-up process, uh, maybe we should take a short break. And we'll come back here to Santa Monica, California, as the USA Bodybuilding Championships continue. Terry Taylor, lightweight Chris Faldo, middleweight Vinny Galante, our light heavyweight John Simmons, and the heavyweight Chris Cormier, and they're going at it now, Jim. Here's the free-for-all. They just went through their comparisons, and... They're just banging their best poses and trying to get that crowd to go nuts. And listen <laughs> the to them. The crowd's loving it. Check it out. I tell you, Cormier looks tough. He really does. Uh, I love Chris Faldo. I mean, in terms of his conditioning, he is shredded to the bone. John Simmons is just incredibly complete and in phenomenal condition. You got to pick a winner, though. Look at that shot right there. I think that's your guy. <laughs> that's a pretty impressive lad spread right there. The tough to beat the big guys, Mark. Yeah, he is. And Jim Mannion's going to come out and also hand out the hardware all right talking to the crowd the now. results and, and it's skinny Keeper. kid who won the show last year he had a pretty good 1993 so far he won the pro iron man he won the arnold classic he won two shows in europe and he's heading for atlanta september 11th to chase dorian yates 250 pounds now the fabulous flex wheeler and they're welcoming flex wheeler out on stage right now this guy's a legend he just won the Arnold Classic, and he's uh, one of the head front runners in uh, the Olympia this year. The 1993 USA overall bodybuilding champion. Chance to turn pro. He said he was going to come here for a knockout, and he did. Chris Cormier. Ah, <laughs> uh, there he is. Yeah, there he is. Oh knockout. man, it looks tremendous amount like Evander Holyfield. That's why they were Ronnie Tebow was teasing him there, but I tell you. Keith Angelin and Flex Wheeler. Keith Angelin from Twin Lab. Looks like Cormier posed for that statue himself, doesn't it? Yeah, I, I think he's got the statue beat. <laughs> Wheeler's got the statue beat. Jim Mannion, the president of the MPC. 
Uh, well, I don't think there was any uh, any dissension in the crowd there. I think they all agreed on this one. No, this he, he's got he's going to be a very good pro bodybuilder. I'm very happy for him. And I think the other weight class winners, or if they get their turn, uh, could do some damage on the pro level also. Well, they all look fine tonight, and uh, Chris gets a well-deserved congratulations from Flex Wheeler there. And we'll be coming back to talk to our winners, Denise Rakowski and Chris Cormier, when we return to Santa Monica, California, and the USA Bodybuilding Championships. Chris Evander Cormier, you promised a knockout punch tonight. You were true to your word. Uh, I gave it every ounce of what I had all year long, and... Um, I want to thank the Lord, my family, my friends, everyone stood behind me the whole way. And um, I'm really happy about tonight. One more time, the NPC brings you the finest physiques in the world of amateur bodybuilding. And we'll bring them to you one more time next year.